Do you ever feel like you're being tested as a coach? Whether it's from the first time you meet someone and they ask you what you do, or in a first session with a client, like you're trying to figure them out and prove yourself and prove your techniques and hope that it impresses them enough to want to come back or give them a session and give them a taste. Well, when I started out as a coach over a decade ago, I often felt the anxiety of that kind of a test where I sort of had to prove myself or prove the modality, for instance, the tapping technique that I was using really would work and try to figure person out in those first few moments. And of course, everyone's different. And so someone recently asked me why I'm teaching x-ray vision for coaches and why I'm teaching it in a challenge approach. And it's really because over the past 12 years, I have figured out that although yes, people are different and we have different modalities sometimes as coaches and practitioners and therapists, there's actually layers of what is going on underneath what people present as, what people show up for coaching or helping or support support for. And usually those are behaviors they're doing like procrastination or feeling stuck or feeling anxious or playing small or some variation of those, self-sabotage. And there's actually very specific and repeatable layers underneath there. And when you know what they are and understand them, it's like having x-ray vision and it makes everything you do from that moment on a breeze with your client. And these layers are unknown to your client. And so when you know they're there and you speak to them and you point them out, it always creates a huge aha moment for someone. They will say, Wow, because it will resonate and they will see you as often they say being a mind reader or being psychic or just impressed that you somehow know something about them. Also in those layers, you will start to see that there's deeper costs sometimes than the person has really been sitting with of those issues. And then there's also another thing, which is the root cause, the hidden roots underneath why that is showing up for them. Now, you don't know what that specifically is for any clients, but when you have this x-ray vision, you know it's there, you know about where it is, you know what's going to be associated with it, so you know the right questions to ask, to bring it out, to reveal it often in another big aha moment, because most people don't realize what's actually connected and going on to some of their complaints and their struggles. I'm teaching this because this is a skill that when you have it, when you see it, you can't unsee it. You will see it in yourself. You will see it in people in your life that you want to help, and you'll be able to not have to prove yourself, prove anything, explain how your technique or pr approach is great, but really just give them something that is actually an amazing gift without being a freebie. It's clarity. It's clarity about what's actually happening with them, what the roots of that is, and how much it's costing them. And that clarity is mind blowing for most people. Most people are just starving for clarity and it sets you apart from moment one as a coach. This is a technique that can be used regardless of whether you're using tapping, the technique that I do, or any other technique. It can be used inside of a session from a first conversation and into what we call an enrollment conversation where you offer someone like the correct package and, and the real work that you want to do with them to get to those core issues. That is why I'm teaching x-ray vision for coaches, because I know it made a huge difference in my business and in the thousands of coaches and therapists I've trained in this technique since I started. And I know it can make a huge difference for you. Check it out.